The Cannondale Quick CX-3 is a bike built for city rides and light off-road adventures. I've had the chance to use it for a while, and I think it works well if you like to ride around town but also explore some less traveled paths. It feels like a good balance between comfort and functionality, with a few key features that stand out. First off, the frame is made from Smartform C3 alloy, which makes it feel lightweight but still strong. I noticed that it's easy to handle, even in tight spaces or when weaving through traffic. The bike has a suspension fork with 63 millimeters of travel, which helps absorb bumps and cracks on the road. It's not meant for serious mountain biking, but it does the job well for city streets with potholes or casual rides on gravel paths. The suspension also has a lockout feature, which I found helpful when riding on smooth roads. It keeps the ride more efficient by not letting the fork move when you don't need it to. The bike's drivetrain is Shimano 8-speed, which is pretty basic but works fine for most city riding. The gears shifted smoothly, and I didn't have any issues with them when riding up small hills or picking up speed on flat roads. It uses hydraulic disc brakes, which are made by Tektro. I like these brakes because they give a strong and reliable stop, which is important, especially when you're in busy traffic or going downhill. The tires on this bike are Vittoria Terreno Dry 700X40C. They're designed to handle different surfaces, which I found useful when switching from pavement to dirt paths. They grip well enough for some off-road sections, but they still roll smoothly on the road. They also come with reflective strips, which make you more visible when riding at night or in low light. I think that's a nice safety feature, especially if you're riding in the evening. Comfort is one of the things I appreciate most about this bike. The riding position is more upright, which feels natural and gives you good visibility. You don't feel hunched over, so it's easier on your back and neck during longer rides. The saddle is also pretty comfortable, and the grips on the handlebars have a nice feel, which helps make the ride more pleasant, even on bumpy roads. One thing to note is that the bike doesn't come assembled, so you'll need a professional to put it together. That's something to keep in mind because if it's not assembled correctly, you could run into issues down the road. I also noticed that while it has good reflective details, it doesn't come with built-in lights. If you plan on riding at night, you'll need to buy lights separately. Another feature worth mentioning is the connectivity with the Cannondale app. The bike comes with a wheel sensor that tracks your rides, giving you useful data like speed, distance, and calories burned. I found this feature to be a nice bonus for someone who likes to keep track of their rides without needing a separate device. It's pretty simple to use once you set it up, and it adds a bit more to the overall experience, especially if you're someone who likes to see progress or map out routes. It's not a necessity, but it's a nice extra touch that enhances the ride in a low-key way. Overall, I think the Cannondale Quick CX-3 is a solid choice for someone who wants a bike that can handle city riding but also wants the option to go off-road sometimes. It's comfortable, handles well, and has features that make it a good all-rounder without being too specialized in any one area.